So a few times a year, they stop automotive traffic in various places around LA. This is the Ciclavia Bicycle Rally. This one is in Hollywood. This is 6.2 miles from West Hollywood to East Hollywood, and they close down the streets. There's a few places where the cars can go through where they'll stop you occasionally, but pretty much you're just running all the way up Santa Monica Boulevard, all the way to Hollywood Boulevard, all the way to East Hollywood from West Hollywood. Uh, unicycles are welcome. Also, e-bikes are welcome. Hey, Waldo's welcome. I found them. So there's a good look at the Hollywood sign. And if you're not a super cyclist and you can't ride six miles, it's okay. There's a lot of stops along the way where they have swag and stuff you can get you know free stuff vendors uh, umbrellas with picnic tables where you can have a snack and i saw people of all ages and abilities here even little kids on those push bikes where you just you know run like fred flintstone on the street uh, and all kinds of uh, different city initiatives to get people kind of out of their cars and onto bikes and walking around a lot of a lot of different stuff going on here so it's not just about getting on your bike and going as fast as you can and if you don't have a bike and you show up on the east end of this particular ride, there's a Goodwill. You can go in there and grab one at a bargain price. So the Ciclavia website has all the info on this. Of course, I will put a link to it in the description of this video. And this is just a, a look at what it's like to be riding down Hollywood Boulevard when there are no cars around. There are dogs, there's little kids. It's, it's, there's just as much traffic. It's just slower and friendlier than it is when the cars are out. A lot of you know me as the e-bike guy and... This is probably, this end of it, it's probably 25 to 30 miles from my house. So I was originally going to ride my e-bike up here, but a lot of the things on the Ciclavia website said that it was human-powered only. Look at this lady. She's got a bike on her bike. <laughs> it's all about bikes. That's a super mom right there. But So I didn't bring my e-bike. I, I actually drove my Prius, I guess, it's, which is semi-eco-friendly with the folding bike in the back and then did this ride. But then I, it turns out that there were a ton of e-bikes there, a lot of people on e-bikes. There's no, there were cops riding around on bikes, but they weren't busting anybody or, or doing any, uh, you know, hassling of anybody that wasn't on a human powered bike. So you're totally fine to do one of these on an e-bike as well. And what I did not see was anybody pulling wheelies or terrorizing anybody or doing anything dangerous. Everybody was just super chill. And it was just a real, real peaceful day of people just riding bikes and having a good time. And down in the tourist part of Hollywood Boulevard, down by the Chinese Theater, there's a lot of activity as well. And it's really, it's like a fun chance for tourists and non-tourists alike to get down here and just kind of check it out when things are mellow and you don't have to fight with traffic, uh, human traffic in cars, that is. And you can just kind of cruise around and see the sights. Look for the stars of your favorite actor. I found Hildegard. <laughs> I don't know who Hildegard is, but... Uh, Thank you for your service and check it out down in front of the Chinese theater. There's a band playing samba music and there are a whole bunch of swag tents. There's even a bike repair tent for people who can, uh, you know, there are people who can fix your bike if you have a flat tire or need some help. So just all manner of free stuff, uh, paid stuff, advertising and infomercials and uh, things to encourage people to ride bikes. So overall, I'd advise checking out Ciclavia L.A., and going on one of these rides if there's one near you or, or even if there isn't i think i'm going to do the downtown one as well i've always wanted to go check out little tokyo and it'd be a perfect time to kind of jump on the subway get down there and then uh just ride around with no cars downtown <laughs> Whoa, it's William Shatner's hands. And Bruce Willis is getting walked on all day long. He's in a high traffic area, unfortunately. It's very hard to get a picture of Bruce Willis without people's feet getting in the way. Of course, all kinds of merch. You can get yourself a, a Oscar if you don't already have one. There's one there in the window. And then the terms and conditions are posted along the route. So I guess if you're riding on the route, you have agreed to them automatically. So freeze that and read it if you want to know exactly what you're in for. And look there in the distance, my favorite celebrity-owned restaurant. So we're going to stop there, get a little fortification for the ride home. This is kind of halfway between West Hollywood and East Hollywood. Of course, that is uh, Danny Trejo's coffee shop, where they also make Trejo's breakfast burritos there, which are quite good. And, of course, they have merch. So if you live in the city and you're looking for a fun day on a bike, check it out. Ciclavia, L.A. Highly recommended. Fun for the whole family. You have no excuse. 
the big people are riding, the little people are riding, and the medium-sized people are riding. The tricycles are there, the unicycles are there, the e-bikes are there. Everybody's there. So uh, the only person who is not there is you. So go to their website and find out when the next one is. There's, they're all over town, so I'm sure there's one you can get to.